Hey D-Bags, welcome to this week's 89141. This week we have sports superstitions, some pointless bids, and a new teacher feature. But first, next Monday and Tuesday, Student Council will be selling candy grams during lunch. They'll be delivered on Valentine's Day the 14th during 6th period. So send some sweet sweets to your sweetie. In other news, help support St. Baldrick's Foundation. The foundation is to help conquer kids' cancer. When $500 is reached, Mr. Whitefoot himself will shave his head. To make donations, visit room 1307. Next Wednesday, February 15th, will be the first meeting for the Cheese Club. It's $10 per semester and in room 502. The advisor is Ms. Harson. I know I'm going to the Cheese Club, but I know I'm not going to be cutting the cheese. Um, speaking of teachers, this week's teacher feature is the new English teacher, Mr. Estrada. Check it out. Teacher. Teacher. Swag. Teacher. Teacher. Swag. Teacher. I'm actually originally from Juarez, Mexico, but I didn't live there. And, well, I lived there as a child, but I don't really remember it very much. So I lived in Reno as a kid. Um, when I was in middle school, I moved to Germany, and I grew up there until I graduated high school, and I came here to Vegas to go to UNLV for college. I love it. I mean, the, the sight of seeing somebody get something that they didn't get before, and aside from that, the fact that I can just that reading and writing and stuff like that is my career. I mean, I can't imagine anything else I'd rather be doing. I, I play a lot of video games. I read and write obsessively. Obviously, I do that pretty much all day and night unless I'm watching TV or playing video games or something. And also, I, uh, I build Warhammer models, little miniature army guys. You paint them up. It takes a lot of detail. Mm. It's a hobby. It keeps me busy. First up in sports, we have some sports superstitions, then a commercial about the track and intramurals. Then a Bianca V with entertainment. Before every game, I double knot my shoes. So like it brings, it tells me like I have good luck in the game, so I score more points and we can win the game. Before every game, I have to make sure I wear my lucky hair tie because I feel like it brings me good luck. Before every soccer game, I kick myself in my cleat and it helps me stay focused. Yeah. Entertainment, and this week we have a new segment called Parody Pantry, and we're starting a new program that's called um, To Write Love in Her Arms. And since it was a Super Bowl last week, I wanted to get um, your guys' favorite commercials, so check it out. One dance, just one dance. I'm going to the dance in my vibe. People in one car almost died in an accident by a spotted from afar. It's dance time, we having fun. Wish I had a date, I'd be having more fun. And if I trip and fall, I still have some fun. Check out my dance meet as we swagging, I'm done. It's Sadie's, Hawkins, wear girls, ass guys, dance stupid, off with issues, people dancing pairs, two by two. Yeah, I'm so young and funny, got a gun on my son, and her dress her bun. Can't wait to get to the dance and boogie, can't wait, yeah. All the people do is Dougie, I dance all night if I can. Just got a date, yeah, man. Oh my gosh, he likes look at her boobs. Sadie's. My favorite 
favorite Super Bowl commercial was the sketches one because Mr. Quigley is a little dog's name. He just killed it with the last moonwalk at the end. And there's the favorite silver prince. And we have a late entry named Mr. Quigley. Is he wearing running shoes? It is legal, I believe. And they're off with Queen's Hurricane out front. Silver prince on his heels. But wait, Mr. Quigley is coming around the outside. Look at that little guy go. It's going to be Quigley. What? Let's do it. <laughs> walking across the finish line. The new Midfoot Strike Sketchers Go Run. Go like never before. What do you mean you want a new contract? My favorite Super Bowl commercial was the M&M one. So then I said, Mr. Prime Minister, I'm flattered that you love chocolate, but I'm here strictly in a professional. What's wrong with him? He thinks you're naked. My shell is brown. It just looks like my milk chocolate is showing. Only a fool would think I'd actually show up naked. So it's that kind of party. Hit it! I'm sexy and I know it. Hey! Look at that body. Look at that body. Look at that body. I work out. Wiggle, 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 yeah. If you saw me in the halls, you probably wouldn't believe that I've thought about ending everything before. It's crossed my mind so many times in my past that it reduced me to a low I was barely able to even fathom. I got back on my feet though. I came back with the thought that if you keep a positive mentality, positive things will come to you. Well, that's all we have for you this week, D-Bags. Don't forget to go to our website at dohsdispatch.net. You guys should leave comments on any segments you've seen. You could suggest songs that I should parody, suggest pointless vids, and suggest questions for Wayne's World. Please make sure they're school appropriate or we will not read them. Well, that's all we have for you this week, D-Bags. I'm Rob. And I'm Amy. See, See you next, next week, D-Bags.